If you're struggling with the impact of daylight savings, you're not alone. Kelowna Sleep Clinic specialist Dr. Ronald Cridlin says most people would be back on track after a day or two, but a lot of how you feel has to do with the light. So we live in a 24-hour world, but our biological clock is 24 hours and 15 minutes. And if we don't get that light first thing in the morning, our biological clock will drift that 15 minutes. Um, but our biological clock also has the ability to s change at the rate of an hour per day if we get the light early enough. In order to change your biological clock, Dr. Cridlin says key steps include getting up earlier and getting the light in your eyes earlier. And that resets your biological clock, so your brain is releasing melatonin earlier, getting you ready for sleep earlier. Insomnia can also play a factor. If somebody has trouble sleeping at the best of times, this is going to throw them off. Okay. Mm -hmm. And um, so good sleep habits are important as well to try and optimize the sleep and the transition into these changes. Good sleep habits include taking an hour to wind down before bed and trying to avoid technology within that hour. The brightness has been found to delay the onset of melatonin and flashing lights stimulates the brain. For Castanet News, I'm Madison Earhart in Kelowna. <laughs>